One of the best ways to level up your videos is to level up your lighting. And in this video, we'll be looking at the GVM 800D RGB LED video kit. This RGB LED video light panel uh, with vibe color feature allows you to adjust the color temperature from 3200 to 5600 Kelvin, which is what I use to light my subjects or myself. So usually right now I'm lit at about 4900 Kelvin, but that depends on the circumstance, but you have the ability to change that. And then for the RGB feature, you can adjust the hue output from anywhere from zero to 360 degrees from the color spectrum. And then you can adjust the color saturation from zero to 100%, giving you a natural and vivid shooting effect. And we have an operator triggering the lightning effect. The next one on here is the paparazzi, and this is designed basically to look like photo flashes. We can change the brightness of it. In this example, we're using one of the lights about waist high to create the cop car effect, and the other light in the back. An outdoor scene with a campfire. One of the lights is placed offset to create some. Example, one of the lights is placed up on a table set to the television effect, and the other light is. The next effect on here is party, and this is pretty self explanatory. Uh, this is basically just cycling. But if we switch to the disco mode, it has many of the same controls. But the difference here is evident in the manual is that these two devices, once powered on, already talk to one another, even with RGB mode, and I choose a color, that one dutifully follows along. Barn doors are made out of plastic, but I would say they're pretty sturdy. I don't feel like they're gonna break on me. You can also position the yoke at a at whatever angle you want. Uh, also, you can uh, attach it to the light stand vertically. That way you can get like a top-down uh, lighting scenario. It also comes with a diffusion panel that goes in front of the LED strips. You can go ahead and take that off if you want to. I like to keep it on just because it diffuses the light. You can power these lights two different ways. You can obviously use the adapters that come with the light and gives it constant power, which I love using the L-series batteries, and those definitely last for over an hour uh, when powering it up about 80%.